For more than three decades, Professor Venugopal Naya has been studying birds and what makes them sick. His work, along with Chinese researchers, could have an impact on thousands of farmers worldwide. CIRAD is a virtual network of British and Chinese scientists that was launched in 2015 to combat avian diseases. Its aim is to help raise standards in the global poultry industry. The research taking place here is of particular interest to China as it has more chickens than any other country in the world. But it's also facing a shortage of meat as millions of pigs have been affected by an outbreak of African swine fever across Southeast Asia. And as Chinese demand for other types of protein grows, the safety of that food is high on the agenda. In 2019, several cases of bird flu were reported in China with tens of thousands of poultry culled as a result. And Chinese imports of chicken are surging too, reaching a value of $1.3 billion in the first nine months of last year, a rise of almost 48% year on year. So there is a huge increase in the poultry uh, uh, industry uh, at the moment, which uh, puts a lot of pressure on uh, diseases also. So controlling these diseases to make uh, more poultry, meat and eggs uh, is uh, another challenge. Dr. Yong Xu Yao was one of the founding members of CIRAD and oversees other Chinese researchers here on the outskirts of London. She thinks the project is evidence of the growing research ties between the two countries. Because we have been uh, collaborating for the last 10 years or so, and uh, we have uh, uh, several research fundings, and uh, we have joint uh, research projects going on. And then we both sides are benefiting from the collaboration. And uh, that's why we, you know, the science is uh, not to do with uh, um, politics. CIRAD missed out on the Newton Prize this month, but despite falling short, the scientists here are hoping their work can improve the lives of millions of birds, as well as the safety of our food. Noe Jibakil, CGTN, Woking in England.